how do you feel you're playing right now, and is there any difference you're feeling right now than maybe what you're doing like three or four games in uh, I mean, anytime you're coming off, you know, a tough stretch of, of games where you're losing, um, you're just searching for a win. And I think we got one last night. It was a, or yeah, last night a really good win. And it's always tough to beat a team twice. They had had a couple guys out. Uh, but we just had to still be sharp and locked in mentally, regardless of who was out there. You know, at the end of the day, it's NBA players, and they they gave us a tough game. You know, they they played hard. They they played like they believed they could win the game, and we had to do what we had to do once again. Um, but I think it was just good for us to feel good about what we were doing. You know, I think we got our pace up. Um, you know, we flew around. We played physical. I mean, we fouled a lot. We would like to foul less than we have been, but. Play physical, we played with pace. Um, you know, we just had some purpose. The ball was hopping around, confident. Uh, you know, I think this is how we got to play if we want to be successful. So, uh, obviously, like I said last night, there's still things you could look at in last night's game and tonight's game and say, we could do this better and it'll be an easier game. But everybody's walking away from, you know, game saying that, whether they win or lose. So, I think we got to be happy with the fact that we're playing a way that's like positive and fun to watch and also giving us a chance to win and you know we just got to keep making corrections and it's better to you know to do that in wins than losses. How do you think Dawson looked at his first game back? I thought he looked great. Um, you know he, he was flying around you know crashing offensive glass like we used to him seeing. He was shooting the ball with confidence um, and just having guys out there if they're going to you know run two guys at myself run two guys at Ant, and having a guy out there that can raise up and make that three confident like he was tonight is a that's a weapon for us. Um, and I told him a few days ago when I watched them playing a stay ready game um, after we lost Orlando, um, they were playing, you know, for like 30 minutes and Nas was just out there in attack mode. He looked confident. He looked, you know, like he was really believing. Um, and I told him I, I noticed it, you know, play with that same energy in the game. And I think he came out tonight and um, he was excited to be back. He had a long time away. Um, and I just think his mind is clear. He's fresh and he, he looked good. What do you think of those kind of smaller lineups that Chauncey went with in the fourth quarter, the ones with like Jabari at the five, that you were in one of them, and one of them, like, that was kind of a look that we haven't really seen in the last. Yeah, I mean, we got a, we got some guys on our team that, that bring different things to the table. You know, Bari is a guy that can make threes. He can switch and guard every position. He's a great rebounder. Um, he plays physical. You know, it's... You're going to see that. You know, you got to throw those lineups out there to, to kind of create an issue for the other team. And... Um, I feel like in situations it was stuff we could have did better, areas where we struggled at. I think one time we gave up like five offensive rebounds in one possession. I don't know if that was the group. I think Drew was in at that time, but um, I think the lineup was pretty small at that time. And, you know, it's some things we got to clean up, but I think we kind of just ran with whatever, you know, CB decided. It was like small lineup, big lineup, starters, whatever. We just kind of kept doing what we needed to do. So, um, you know, I, I, I feel good about it. You know, I feel like our pace was really good with that small lineup, too. You know, just a lot of good action. What do you think about your, your rhythm offensively lately? It seems like you're, it, it's coming as easy as it was earlier in the season. And also, are you are you making concerted attempts to get to the rim a bit more right now? Yeah, I mean, i just been attacking. You know, like I said yesterday, i just been attacking, I think. Um, you know, we got a lot of guys that are capable on our team this season, so I've kind of taken a um, position of just kind of assessing the game to start, and I've stopped doing that. You know what I mean? I'm a, I'm playing the game honest. Like, okay, if two people come to me, I'm gonna give it up. But um, you know, I've just been coming out out the gate to attack. You know, getting downhill, get in the paint, um, just make them have to address whatever I'm doing, and then just go from there. Um, you know, and that's playing with more pace. You know, not walking the ball up so the defense can get set, getting the ball up the floor, random actions. You know. Moving them side to side, just you know, just giving them a lot to, to think about and a lot to deal with, and um, just being aggressive. You know, it's more of a mentality than me changing how I play. Um, you think that's reflecting the balance, the scoring balance, twenty twenty twenty. I think so. I mean, it's you come out, you super aggressive. Last night I was super aggressive, and um, you know, I, tonight it was like they were denying me full court to start in you know, the end of the second quarter and to start for the rest of the second half. Then they just started running two people at me as soon as I cross half court. Before I cross half court, sometimes running two people at me, and um, I think when I'm aggressive and I'm, you know, having my way, and they got to do that as soon as, as soon as the ball goes out, we got an advantage. And if we take an advantage of it, you know, it's gonna be like, okay, do I close out to Ant or Jeremy? And then Ant, Jeremy hit two threes to start the third, and we get it in the, in the middle of the defense. The big steps up, and now Nurk is getting fouled or getting a layup. So I think it does 
you know, just help find that balance, you know, where guys can, you know, just get it a little easier.